Welcome to another AV Properties house tour. Hi guys, let me tell you the top three reasons why this property is for you. This is the most ideal enclave in BF Homes plus it's walking distance to Molito. It's continuous use of mahogany woods for all the doors and the staircase planks. Wow, look at the extra high ceilings. And guys, it doesn't stop there so you have to finish the video to find out more. Hi guys, finally we're back in BF and today we will explore this contemporary brand new two-story home with an imposing facade and an admirable workmanship within. So are you guys ready to check it out? Let's go! I'm making my way downtown. Okay, here we are in your porch and your carport. So you can fit comfortably two cars and then the door Behind me is an access to your utility area and your helper's room with an ensuite toilet and bath. How nice is that? And then on the opposite side of the property, you have your front and side garden. This one is landscape, but if you want to adjust it up a little bit, it's totally up to you. I'm thinking there could be like a coffee table here or you want to keep it as is. Okay, so we'll climb up your porch and let's see what's behind this solid mahogany in entry door let's go wow okay the acs are on and the first door to the right is the first thing we'll be checking out so this property has a den slash office with a toilet and bath so this could easily be another bedroom so if you have seniors or children this could be the perfect room for them and what's nice about this room is you get to enjoy a view of your front garden. Nice, right? Now guys, let's check out how the toilet and bath in this room looks like. So this one will be working as your powder room slash full bath. So we have your shower room right below. Ta-da! So this, this one is nicely spaced. You have your water closet and a floating sink. So this is really nice. And then all the doors, including, of course, the main entry is solid mahogany and all of the bedroom doors and toilet doors. Okay, now this is your receiving area. So it's nice. It's a nice um, corridor that will open up the ground level to your living area and to your gorgeous show kitchen, which we'll be showing later on. So here we are, guys. Let me stand underneath. Um, the inverter AC so we have six of these units all throughout the house and look at this it's white painted walls and then a the perfect contrast would be your heavy-duty industrial grade sliding doors that frames your glasses so this is nice matibay and of course it opens up to your patio or lanai and then you have an access to your side garden, which is really nice. I mean, we love the contrast of the colors. You have your bright greens to the right, and then of course, something industrial right in front of you. And then after the living area, we find ourselves in what looks like the spot for your dining table. So this one can fit a six to eight seater dining table, and then you could put up a little cute chandelier that'll hover um, right above your dining table. And then a few steps away from your dining area is your gorgeous show kitchen. Like what I mentioned, um, before we enter the property, guys, you will really admire the workmanship and you know the top-notch finish and fixtures used in the build of this property. Look at this. You have um, Carrara quartz for all the countertops from the main kitchen to the utility or auxiliary kitchen. So that is a plus in our list. You have this extra large sink and then a movable faucet head. 
And then what's nice about this one is, while you're cleaning up the dishes, you have this counter right here. So this one is a nice tangile accent wood. So this could also be a breakfast spot for you and your family. And then whenever they're you know, rushing down from the second floor, you see, and you get to count your family members, which is nice. I think. Okay, so from that spot moving in over here, you'll see your beautifully um, designed modular cabinetry. So these are a European brand. So you have one right here and then the gray ones that is a really nice palette combination with your wood finished um, cabinetry down below. So again, modular cabinet and it's soft close again. So we love how seamless and modern the design is. You won't see any knobs and handles. Also guys, um, before I forget to mention and move on to the next part of the house, our cabinetry and drawers, so it actually leaves you a lot of you know, space and spot to play and ideas to put in because it's kind of bare right now. So you could install a like a dish tray, a stainless steel dish tray right here. Okay, my bug's tired. Then. <laughs> okay, and then after this one, so yeah, you have a lot of play, uh, space to walk around and move around. And then this door will be leading us to where our auxiliary slash utility area and where you're, you will find the helper's room. So this is nicely spaced. They have their own overhead cabinetry and an sweet bath, which is really spacious. We'll show you snippets of that one later on. So here in your auxiliary kitchen, you have a row of cabinetry and overhead space for more storage, and then down below, which is really nice. And we love how nicely spaced this one is. And right behind the camera, we have another access. So let me shimmy to the side. So here you have your laundry area that gives you another access that'll lead you to your patio, lanai, and your side garden. How beautiful is this property? It's, it has this uncomplicated layout. So I know you and your family, especially the kids, are gonna enjoy, you know, going around, creating fun memories with everybody. Nice. <laughs> okay, so we are done with the entire tour of the ground level. Guys, follow me as we check out what is on the second floor. Okay, this is not working, so we're gonna use this other sliding door. Bigat! It's gonna give you a good arm workout. Let's go! Okay, so we're stepping on solid mahogany plants for our staircase and guys I know you can see it you have your immaculate white picture walls on both sides so again it's a perfect spot for your family portraits that lights up as you go up the staircase that is really nice and sweet right okay so we are now here on the second level so again for the lot size of this property they've really done a lot for this house no space no room has been compromised and i'd love to invite you guys over to check this out so you can see it for yourself so the first thing that will be i'll be showing you is of course within the corridor within the hallway you have your linen closet so you can open two doors you have multiple layers and then a nice exposed shelves for some of the things that you're proud of to display Okay, all right, first bedroom. Now we have four bedrooms all in all on this level. If you want to include the den, then that is room number five. So here we are on your first regular bedroom. Again, no space is compromised. It might look a little small from this angle or the video doesn't do it justice. But again, you have to check this one out for yourself. So let's see how do we position the bed. So this could be where your headboard is and you get to enjoy the natural lighting. And this one, the orientation for this bedroom, I believe, is facing east. So yes, morning sun. And then as we move a few steps away from that spot, you find a really tall, so this is floor to ceiling, um, built-in cabinetry or closet. 
So let me show you what it looks like inside there. You have a lot of space for your stuff. And then let's check out the toilet and bath. So all bedrooms have their own TNB. So this one is your shower area. You have your awning and your shower niche, water closet. And I'm, I'm a big fan of the floating vanity. I love that one so much. So you could clean up underneath and you could also store your toiletries and cleaning stuff right below. Nice. Okay, now on to bedroom number two. So I might have been wrong when I said that all bedrooms uh, enjoy their very own toilet and bath. Okay, except for bedrooms two and three because the siblings would have to share their Jack and Jill toilet and bath. Okay, so again guys, sharing is caring. This one is much, much bigger than the bedroom one toilet and bath, of course. You'll be sharing it with a sibling. You have a larger counter. Of course, it's floating and a bigger vanity mirror. All right, so let's open up the door that'll connect us to bedroom number three on this floor. Again, it's the same um, floor size or area, really nice. You could position your headboard here or right here. So you have two options and then you still have a lot of space to move around. Okay, let's exit bedroom three so we could check out the master bedroom. Let's go. Okay, we love the extra large um, glass right here or window. So this one is a corner frame uh, glass window, which is nice. So if you want more privacy, you could just um, incorporate a Venetian line, correct? And then you have your walkthrough closet. So again, in the video, video it might look a little, you know, too narrow. But yeah, you have to see this property for you to appreciate how beautiful the design, the layout, and the finishes are. And yes, personally, I love the exposed shelvings, but you could have this one enclosed if you want. And then after your walkthrough closet, here we are in your master toilet and bath again you have the option to have this one in close to we have like some kind of a yeah this partition right here and then here we are so it's nice because it's like a subtle design break from what or how the bedroom looks like so this one is a deeper shade of gray so it's very classic um it feels like it's easier to maintain compared to you know, a light, lighter colored um, tiles. So you have, again, your extra large vanity mirror, an extra large sink, so you don't need to divide that one into a his or her sink. All right, so there you have it, guys. I hope you enjoyed our tour of the master bedroom because I did 100%. So yes, it's time for us to go downstairs and chit chat some more. Let's go. So we have just finished our tour of this gorgeous contemporary two-story home. So it's time for us to do a quick recap of the property details. This house sits on a 204 square meter lot area with a total floor area of 250 square meters. It has four bedrooms, a den on the ground level, an open floor layout, a gorgeous show kitchen, and a lot more now if you want to see this property all you have to do is send us a message okay now guys before i let you go please don't forget to click subscribe to av properties official youtube channel ring this bell so you get notified whenever we drop our videos here we are on social media like facebook instagram tiktok and a lot more just type in av properties underscore official and you can send us a message there you can check out our full property listings all you have to do is head on to www.avpropertiescorp.com. Once again, my name is Apple Grace and this is AV Properties, new home, new story. Bye!